to another beautiful section after the video. Today I want to show you how to replace a 40 coil. You know, in the last video I taught you how to dictate 40 in a coil. You can see this. If you put it, I showed you two different methods. Just just check the video if you don't know how to test. So how do we repair the coil? Now let's open this. <coughs> now this is the coil that is there initially. If you look at this one, this one is currently 40, it has, it's bond, it has bond, so you can see the other one here, the coil got bond, so I have to replace it. Now you have two options, although based on the type of coil it's using, now for this one, they glue this one to this plastic. So in this kind of case now, in case you decide to still use this cover, all you have to do is cut this place out, remove this, okay, now let me, uh -huh, this is what it looks like. See this cover here, yeah? because the one you get in the market, we have the one they sell like this, and this one they sell like this, that has the hedges, everything there. Why this one is ordinary, so if you are buying this type, all you need to do is set it here, yeah? then the polarity curves, set it to the place, so it with this edge, the other side, so it with this edge, and put it as well, okay? But I don't like using that one. I prefer the one I can just put very fast because I like saving time. But that little box will not cost me too much. But in case you are saving, so just get this one, it's ordinary. In my side, they sell this one ordinary for one five. This one that is one dollar for this. This one is just like two dollars. So if you are putting that one, just put it the hedge, so the tier, the other hedge. This is what I mean by that. You see the hedge is here. So it will come this way to have this wire. So you are the one that will sew it, so that it will be able to contact with this area. Is that clear now? But I'm not using that type. The type I'm using is this. So this one, I just need to plug it in, and I'm good to go. So if I want to check if it is still good, so I just need to touch it. And let me plug it in. Can hear it now. So this one is still good, very okay. So all I need to do is put it inside. Since I'm not using this gummy method and soldering, I'm just using the complete pack. So I'm just going to put it inside. See me? Just plug in very fast. I don't need this cover again because this edge will still be in contact with my cover. So then I need to put my boot. Uh, so that's the other one. Okay, let's just put it, see it very simple like ABC. So let's tie it back. When you are done, you don't apply too much speed. So that's all. See, so buying the complete is more easy. See, I'm not wasting time, so I can easily do 10, 20 of this very, very fast. So let's check it now. Let's test if it is working or not. Put your wire to the edge, the other side. Idea. So, if you have a 9 volt battery, no problem. Let's check. So it's working already. Or use the second method. Just touch your battery. It's working. Or use your multimeter. Touch the edge and the other one too. You can see the continuity sign. So this is good and already in shape. So I already gave you two options. Either you go through the tough route, buy this, then you have to put gum here. You can see you have to buy gum, apply it here, set it where. Then the edge, that is this edge here. So after gumming it this way, the edge you pass it through this place. You sew it there so that it will be able to contact this side and this one to sew it to the side too. So that's just it. 
easy like ABC so any method any uh, depending on the type of coil you prefer to get so it will give you the same result thank you like share this video subscribe if you've not joined this family thank you see you in the next video